Tariq? What do you want? We don't have anything here but a few scraps of food. Well, relax. Troy sent me. Troy? Oh, thank God. I've been a nervous wreck since I found this kid. He's got nobody to look out for him. But I'm not so good with kids, you know. That's not why I'm here. But Troy promised she'd send someone. I need to get into the museum. The museum? But Troy told me someone would come to help. She promised- Okay, Tariq. You, you tell me how to get into the museum, and maybe I can sort out your problem here, okay? Rise controls the museum. He would kill you on sight. Well, then I can't have him see me. Now, Troy said you used to be the curator, and that if anybody would know a way in, it'd be you. So, how do I do it? <laughs> do you have scuba gear, perhaps? <laughs> no. Too bad. There's an entrance under the surface of Emerald Pond, but it would be a long swim under the water. You would most likely drown. Yeah, well, most likely isn't definitely, so... I guess I'll give it a try.
Not now. <sighs> Troy. I hear you. I'm in. That was the easiest part of this. You realize that, right? You really suck at pep talks, Troy. Not my job. But good luck. The last time we met, you took something of mine. Now, I took something of yours. I don't negotiate with assholes, Rice. I get out of here with Jade, or I take your other hand, too. Your choice! You cannot simply demand to have her, Crane. You must make a showing of effort first. Attack! Move it, boys, move it! Go, go, go! <sighs>
Oh, shit. No. Not now. Jade! Oh, shit. Oh, shit, what have they done I'm... to you? Fine, Crane. To hear knocked me over the head before he dumped me in here. Just... Give me a minute. Oh, I'll be right as rain. You don't have the luxury of a minute, Scorpion. In fact, what little time you have, you owe to me. Thanks to your repair of my antennas, Crane, I've listened to every word any of you have said. How do you suppose I found you, Miss Aldemir? Or the good Dr. Camden? How do you think I broke the connection between the sectors? I am the director of this film. And now that I have Zera's research, the GRE will do as I command them, which renders the two of you useless. Tahir! Took offense, Crane, as I recall, at being referred to as a train of money. Look at you now, dancing for our amusement. You are strong enough to have joined me, but you lack the proper character. Consider this a character strengthening exercise. Come on, Jade, let's get out of here. Oh, Jade, are, Jade, are you hurt? Did, they didn't bite you, did they? I'm fine, I'm fine. Just give me a second. Sweet little Jade is far from fine, Crane. She was bitten and infected hours ago. How noble of her to try and hide it from you. Biter got me on the leg. You didn't need to know. Once again, you find yourself with a choice, Crane. Your precious scorpion is about to turn. But so are you. Who will receive the antasy? Who has a hope of living through this encounter? It's up to you now. Jade, here. You take this. No! Look, come on. Listen, I've still got some in my system. You need this worse than I do. Crane, I just want you to promise me one thing. When the time comes, you're the one who takes me out. What? No, promise I... Promise me! Jade, I, I can't... Jade, where are you? Jade? I need you to hear me, Crane. I know you wanted to try and save me. Not everybody would have offered that fire the way you did. But it's too late for that now. It's too late for me. For a while I blamed you for Amir's death. I wanted to kill you.
But I realized it was time for Amir. It was time for him to go. deny it. It's pointless. We get here, and eventually we die. No, not this again! We can do to change that. Make what happens in between count. Green. Amir's life counted, and now he's gone. Rahim's life counted, and now he's gone. If sacrificing my life means saving everyone in Haran, then that's what I want to do. Take that away from me, Crane. I was born premature. The doctors didn't think I was going to live. But I fought. I struggled and I fought. And I worked and worked and worked. I became a champion. I became the Scorpion. I left my mark on the world. It's my time now, Crane. You can't save me. You've got to let me save you. Let me save you. What was that? I'm so sorry. I didn't mean it. One of us has to live, Kyle. You just remember what you promised me. All of this, and still you had your choice made for you. Disappointing, Crane. You, you, you and you. Get in there and kill them. Yeah! 
Nothing you do will make a bit of difference. It's too late. Your whole world's about to turn to shit. And you can do to stop it. You can't win. Why can't you understand that? Rise. You will never know, boy. So Tell him. me where he's going. It is not for you to seek out Rise. Look at that. 
Jade lost her life for this thing. It's just lying on the floor. I guess Rice must have dropped it when he was trying not to get shot, huh? Oh, shit, this is just the tissue samples. Where's the other package? Go to hell, Crane. Wow, to hear. You know, you're looking pretty fucked up, huh? Yeah, those don't look like the kinds of wounds you recover from. So, then kill me. No, no, I shouldn't. I should just leave you here to suffer. That's what you deserve. Yes, then why don't you? Because you're not the kind of loose end you leave untied. Troy, it's Crane. Crane? You're alive. Troy, Jade... Jade's dead. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, Crane. I, I mean it. What happened? Jade saved my life, Troy. Again. She died... saving me. Crane, you've still got to call off the Ministry. That's why Jade sacrificed herself, so you could do this. Is Savvy there? Has he figured out how to get a message through? Yes, but to do it, you need to meet me. I have to give you an amplifier that Savvy says can help us break through the signal jamming. I'll wait for you in the safe zone. Halfway to the antenna, what you'll need to mount the amp. Okay, Troy. On my way. <laughs> This is it for you! You are done, you hear me? You motherfucker! Dr. Camden, it's Crane. Do you copy? Crane, good to hear you're still alive. Did you find Jay? Yeah, yeah, I, I found her. Listen, I also found Dr. Zara's tissue samples, and I'll bring them to you, but, but first there's something else I need to do. <sighs> okay, Crane, but remember, we don't have a lot of time. I know, Doc, but I'm about to buy us time. I'll be in touch. So, what do I have to do? You need to install it at the highest place possible. That way we'll have the best chance to break through. Okay, so let me guess. I need to head out to that giant antenna tower at the edge of town? The fastest way is through the sewers. Savvy will guide you over the radio. So contact him when you get to the other side. And Crane, when you install the amp, make sure to set the correct frequency on your radio. Pull this off, and the entire world will hear you. <sighs> Let's hope so. See you, Troy.